Good morning and welcome back, Wildcats. I'm Layla. And I'm Ramon. You're watching CTV News. Did you have a good break, Ramon? Mm, I did, actually. It was nice to not have to worry about school for a while. Mm. What about you? I had a great break. It was very, 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 very relaxing. Um, let's take a look at what's going on as we kick off April. The premiere of Prom 2023 will be held on Saturday from April 22nd from 7 to 10 p.m. at the East Event Center in Carmel. Juniors and seniors can buy tickets for $40 starting the week of April 17th through the 22nd during luncheons only in the hospitality room. You must show your student ID to purchase these tickets. If you plan to bring a student from another school, you can pick up a guest forms at Mrs. Rogers' desk in the front office. Guest forms must be completed in order to buy a ticket from a, for a guest. Mr. Ellen returns this Thursday, April 6th at 6.30 p.m. in the auditorium. The male beauty pageant is a fun way for Try High Y to raise money for the Julian Center and the 10 males will compete in three rounds. For more, let's take a look at this segment by Matthew and Aaron. So I'm doing a duo with piano and guitar with a friend, and I play the piano. Can you mention who that friend is real quick? Henry Schickel. Looking forward to represent the school and to just show everybody how I play the piano. Some <laughs> friends that ran the Miserable Land proposed to me that it was going to be a good idea, so I just went for it. Alright, so I'm doing a martial arts for this girl. I saw it, so I signed up for it just to see what happens, you know. So I'm going to be maxing out on pull-ups for my talent for this talent. I'm looking forward to just simply kind of having fun. You know, it's my senior year, so I thought just why not do something that will be that I will remember. So, so I did it last year, and that was a lot of fun. Um, I wanted to do something kind of less involved. I was kind of thinking about doing Mr. LN for a while, so um, I thought it would be it would be fun to do it again. So. Plus, I received a lot of pressure, so. Good luck to all the guys that are participating. Juniors, don't forget about the Roach Internship Opportunities. Roach Diagnostics is offering an internship opportunity for interested and qualified juniors to be seniors for the 2023 to 2024 school year. There are seven positions available for this highly competitive opportunity. High achieving students interested in college studies and careers in psychology, biomedical sciences, and mathematics, and etc. are encouraged to apply. Speaking of opportunities, don't forget you are also invited to explore Ball State on April 20th. Explore Ball State State Day is a unique opportunity for high school students to visit the Ball State campus and learn more about the university. Students are responsible for their own transportation to and from Ball State's campus and must reserve a spot with Ball State by going to your school email and search under Mrs. Severson. Once confirmed by BSU, Students must call in their absence for the day on the Ellen attendance line. The absence will be exempt as long as the student returns proof of the attendance to Ms. Bench in the Ellen <laughs> attendance office. This is a great opportunity to see Ball State. Remember, you can check out all these colleges and internship possibilities on the Counselor Connection that is sent out every Friday. Registration for the 20. 23 Lawrence Township eCampus online summer school session is now open to Lawrence Township families. This online summer school offers Lawrence North students the, uh, the opportunity to earn and or recover high school credits during the summer working online through Canvas. Summer sessions begins Monday, June 5th and concludes Thursday, July 20th. Current 9th grade, 10th grade, and 11th graders are at eligible to enroll in up to two LTEC summer school classes. Please note that there is a $25 fee per class for MSDLT students. Students can also take selected classes through Indiana Online Academy, specifically IOA. So if a specific course is not offered by the Township Online Program, AP and Honors. Registration for IOA courses begin today. All courses requested must be approved by the student's assigned counselor. 
This is a last call for FASFA. Help before the April 15th deadline. Ellen will host one more FASFA completion event this Thursday, April 6th from 3.45 to 7 p.m. That's all we have today for you guys. Have a, have a great day, day and go, go Cats! Cats.